Hi there, time for another famous person who loves sports. That's Eliza Dushku walking behind the large green wall here at Fenway. She's from the Boston area, she loves her Red Sox, and now she's being photographed. It's amazing. <laughs> So surreal. Like I grew up coming to Fenway. My three brothers, my father. We used to have the, the way, way, way up high seats. I sat once or twice on top of the monster. But to be in it today, I didn't know they had the Tom Petty. It's good to be king on the wall and the signatures. It's crazy. You were a tomboy growing up. A, yeah, as, as big of a tomboy as, as you could get. You know, as a little girl, literally, I would cut my hair short and wear hand-me-downs, and my father take me into the into the boys' room. That's a little trivia that not a lot of my fans know. Are you one of those who has forgiven Bill Buckner? Yeah, man. I mean, it's, it's a, it's a to game when everybody yeah. makes mistakes. But definitely, I'm, I get passionate about it, but I, I think you can't blame any guy, especially for years and years. No other sports stadiums that I've been to in the in the world like have the energy that Fenway has. You know, and there's nothing like just the when everybody's singing, when everybody's cheering, when everybody's losing their minds. Everybody's just in it. It's pulsating when the, when the flag is going off. How mad would you be if they knocked it down and said, "Let's build a new fancy one with luxury skyboxes"? That'd be really disappointing. I have to say, I've lived in LA for about 12 years now, and I I do go to Dodger games just because I love. I love sports, and um, it's just so different. I mean, it's a beautiful stadium, but it's so spread out, and you just don't get that that sense of that big beating heart. Definitely, everyone always knows where my loyalty lies. <laughs>